Hi, my name is Christian Sloan, and I'm a junior at Murray State University studying fisheries and aquatic biology. Um, I am the middle child of a family of seven, so uh, my mom and dad, and then I have two younger siblings and then uh, two older. Um, I graduated Campbell County High School in 2018, uh, and I love to go on runs. Um, I'm actually on the cross country team at Murray State, and I love fishing, hiking, uh, really anything outdoors uh, is right up my alley. Um, I am currently studying, uh, like I said, fisheries and aquatic biology at Murray State. And the classes I'm taking right now are stream ecology. I'm taking, um, sorry, stream ecology, uh, undergraduate research, as well as chemistry, uh, just general chemistry right now. And, but I've taken a lot of classes like wetland ecology, uh, fisheries management, ecology in general, uh, zoology, botany, uh, fisheries management and uh, limnology. So a lot of classes that are um, in the biology field and specifically in the aquatic field. And I hope to use these in the future uh, to help my career path, whether that's in fisheries or in aquatic biology, um, as well as maybe down the line in, a, uh, in an environmental consulting uh, job. And then one main thing that stuck out to me uh, through just college and through learning is that uh, you can learn to study things, uh, you can hear about topics in class, uh, but the best way that to learn is to get out and experience it uh, for yourself. So I try to apply this to everything I'm doing. Uh, and really, that is like the key thing that I've learned in college uh, and has led me to a lot of success. Um, this summer, I have an internship with the Thomas More Research Station. Uh, that's actually located in Campbell County uh, with Dr. Lorenz and I'm going to be working on the river crew, uh, hopefully studying a bioassessment of uh, different species along the Ohio River. So I'll be going out in the mornings and the afternoons, uh, electroshocking and then looking at some other different uh, field sampling methods. And with this internship, I'm super excited because I want to uh, grow in my research knowledge, uh, grow in my just the application of, of it as well. And then kind of get some uh, valuable research uh, experience and knowledge uh, to help me in my career path. And the conservation district has done a lot for me, uh, but some of the key things that they have helped uh, is that they provide a lot of at-home resources uh, for uh, stream ecology. Uh, for example, like uh, they give a macroinvertebrate index uh, and identification for how healthy a stream might be. And so I've used that in class as well as uh, just kind of in different clubs at school. And then they also uh, have purchased land like the St. Anne's uh, woods and wetlands uh, that I'm super excited about uh, the future opening of all of it to the public. But uh, right now they have hiking trails and some of these different places uh, uh, you can go and uh, really observe nature and be in nature. Uh, I love to do that. And like I said, uh, I've taken like a wetland class, so uh, that's super interesting to me. And the conservation district uh, just gives me just the ability to explore my interests in biodiversity uh, in the community. And I hope to be able to educate others uh, like they do uh, for myself. So. I just wanted to say thank you to the board, uh, the Campbell County Conservation District for awarding me this scholarship. Um, I plan to use it in school um, and to continue my education at Murray State. Uh, it has been a huge blessing. And once again, thank you guys for making this possible. I'm Deborah Myers, a junior at the University of Kentucky. I'm proud to have grown up right here in Campbell County, raised by my loving parents, Cheryl and Steve. Some of my earliest memories are of playing on the farm with my brothers and sisters, showing horses and livestock at the county fair, and my folks actually hosting a stop on the Backroads farm tour. As I grew older, I got really involved in 4-H and developed interests for agriculture, business, and giving back to the community. My senior year of high school, I was elected to serve as the state 4-H president. And in this capacity, I got to travel the Commonwealth and visit over 50 counties, giving speeches, teaching workshops, and meeting people from all walks of life. 
This experience was really transformative and led to my appointment on the State Fair Board and State Board of Agriculture. Currently, I'm a junior at the University of Kentucky, go Cats, triple majoring in finance, marketing, and agriculture economics. Some of the highlights of my college experience so far have been serving as an ambassador for the College of Agriculture and competing on the Agriculture Economics academic team. I feel confident that my college experiences, both in the classroom and in extracurricular activities, have helped prepare me for both my past internships as well as hopefully my future career. In the past, I've interned with the Commissioner of Agriculture with the Kentucky Department of Agriculture, as well as the Cooperative Extension Service um, in Boone County. This summer, I'm really excited to intern with Fifth Third Private Bank in the Wealth and Asset Management Leadership Program. I am so very appreciative for the Conservation District's support and investment in my life that's helped make these opportunities and experiences possible. It's your generosity that's empowering my dreams so that I can enter the workforce as someone ready to enact positive change. Thank you. Hi, I'm Rusty Wolf. Um, I'm currently a junior at the University of Kentucky. I live over on 154 where my family raises Hereford cattle. Uh, a few of my hobbies would be showing cattle. I've done it since I was little and it's my passion and working on tractors. At school, I am majoring in animal science and minoring in plant and soil science. I'm doing this in hopes of when I graduate, becoming an extension agent and working for the university and um, trying to give back to the farming community and everything they've given to me and try and uh, help spread knowledge and research and all that. Currently, I am working at UK's uh, beef research facility in Versailles. Um, there I'm in charge of feeding and maintaining livestock, uh, processing calves and assisting with research. Uh, it's really taught me a lot about the behind the scenes stuff that universities do and I've done internships at extension offices in the past but that's always once you have the research and you're dispersing it. This is showing me how they collect the research, how all the research goes through, and everything that's involved. And uh, it's just very interesting, and I'm really enjoying myself there. I've worked there for the last two years, so it's been a lot of fun. Without the Soil Conservation District, I wouldn't be able to be in school. They have supported my education more than I could ask from any organization. This will be the third time I'm receiving this scholarship and it has meant the world to me. Every time I get that letter that says I got it again, it's it takes my breath away. Um, school is extremely expensive and when I decided to go to UK, my mom told me I'd have to apply to every scholarship available. So them allowing me and giving me this very generous scholarship has helped me so much. So. Thank you to the Soil Conservation District Board, Linda Grizzle, all of you. Thank you all so much.